Buckle up as we're about to plunge into the world of what I deem to be the most cursed guns of 2023. Cursed, you wonder? Well, it's because they're either alarmingly costly, so superb that they almost defy belief, or a mind-boggling mixture of both. We're going to examine pieces from manufacturers such as Matador Arms, Rock Island Armory, Brigara, CMMG, Kadex Defense, and Dillian Rifle Company. These innovators are producing firearms that are genuinely awe-inspiring and pushing the boundaries of what we expect from weaponry. But be warned, if you share my perspective, you might find each gun we discuss from these makers to be intriguingly frustrating in its own unique way. Therefore, to aid you in making the right choice, we've compiled a list of the top six most cursed guns of 2023, detailing their key features as well as factors you need to take into account to ensure you select the one most suitable for your needs. For a more comprehensive analysis and a tool to compare these shotguns side by side, visit our website, gunsyoucantlivewithout.com. Here you'll find a deeper dive into each model, allowing you to understand each shotgun's unique strengths and potential drawbacks. Number 6. Rock Island Armory 5.0 ST Enter the world of Rock Island Armory 5.0 ST, a fresh off the forging press pistol with an operating system that's more than meets the eye. At a cursory glance, it might appear to be just another full-sized hammer-fired pistol chambered in 9mm. That may not be your first choice for concealed carry. However, don't let its humble exterior fool you. With 17 rounds nestled in the mag, it could easily take the throne as a home defense champion. Yet, its heart beats for the competitive field. Evident in its design and construction, it seems born to steal the limelight amidst the fast-paced action of shooting competitions. Peel back another layer of intrigue, and you'll find its full-sized barrel, stretching to 4.9 inches, features an unorthodox square profile. Not immediately noticeable, a closer inspection at the muzzle reveals the story. Unveiling an engineering marvel, it utilizes a linear recoil system that eliminates the need for the barrel to tilt for reloading a new round from the mag. Now, let's talk about the kinship it shares with the CZ-75. Its barrel and slide configuration mimics the iconic design of CZ-75. The barrel nestles deep into the frame, and the slide glides inside the frame. A distinct divergence from the norm where the slide straddles outside the frame. It doesn't stop there. It boasts a few more unique features. The low-bore axis design, an amalgamation of aluminum frame and polymer grip for less heft than its competing peers, adjustable rear and fiber optic front sights, and a trigger with a crisp 4.5 pull weight, along with the trigger blade safety mechanism that Glock made a staple of the industry. Not exactly groundbreaking, but the sum of these parts make for a pistol that deserves a second look. Number 5. Matador Arms Mat 9 they are a Texas-based manufacturer specializing in firearms and accessories. The company is owned by a U.S. Marine veteran and operates across multiple states and coasts. Their dedicated team collaborates to push the boundaries of innovation, continuously developing highly ergonomic and forward-thinking products. Now let's discuss the Mat 9 Upper. Technically, it doesn't qualify as a firearm itself, but it can be used to build an enjoyable firearm. Essentially, it is an upgraded iteration of Matador Arms' previous model, the Monco 9. The Mat 9 Upper is a monolithic blowback-operated billet 9mm upper receiver that doesn't require an AR-15-style buffer and tube. If you're having trouble grasping the concept, think of it as similar to the internals of an AR-18, although not entirely identical. The Mat 9 Upper boasts being a fully self-contained 9mm upper that comes ready for suppressor use right out of the box. It provides a complete bufferless solution and allows for the utilization of a wide variety of pistol magazines with minimal to no modifications. If you've had the pleasure of shooting 9mm with the old Montgo 9, you'll appreciate the fun factor it brings. The new Mat 9 differs only in terms of its sleeker exterior design and being slightly lighter than its predecessor. Number 4. CMMG Descent Mark 57 the CMG Descent Mark 57 is a unique upper setup designed specifically for the 5.7x28mm cartridge, similar to the bufferless system of the Matador Arms Mat 9. However, the key difference lies in the chambering. 
Featuring a 6.5-inch barrel, this upper assembly comes equipped with a Trigger Tech ARD two-stage trigger, along with all the other components found in the Descent upper. Combined with the standard Mark 57 lower commonly found on CMMG's Banshee or Resolute models that are compatible with FN57 magazines. The Descent now offers two options for purchase, one with the AR-style conversion magazines provided by the company and another with the Mark 57 lower. The latter choice might not be practical unless you already own an FN57, making it, in my opinion, a rather perplexing acquisition. Not only does it lack relevance without an FN57, but it also comes with a steep MSRP of $2,200. To compound matters, CMMG sells a 5.56mm version for just two grand, making it $200 more affordable. If you happen to own an FN57, you likely only receive three magazines with the pistol. To utilize the Descent Mark 57 effectively, you'll require additional aftermarket 20-round magazines, priced at $45 each. In comparison, aftermarket mag pull 30-round magazines for a standard AR-15 chambered in 5.56mm are much more economical, with CMMG themselves selling those magazines for just $12.95 apiece. One must seriously question the appeal of purchasing the Descent Mark 57 under these circumstances. Number 3. CDX SS7 Stars Covert Introducing the Kdex Defense CDX SS7 Stars Covert, a remarkable offering from Kdex Defense, a Canadian firearms manufacturer based in saint jean sur Quebec. While you may not be familiar with the brand, allow me to provide some insights. Kdex Defense has gained recognition for producing top-of-the-line bolt-action rifles, precision sniper rifles, rifle chassis, and defense accessories. Despite being a relatively young company, established in 1994 as a manufacturer of testing equipment for helmets and eyewear, they quickly secured contracts with various military units and police departments in Canada. This led to the formation of their defense division. In collaboration with Remington, Kdex Defense played a significant role in developing the RACS chassis for the M2010 Enhanced Sniper Rifle a noteworthy addition to the extensive lineage of military adaptation of the Model 700. KX Defense takes immense pride in their rifle actions, rifle chassis systems, premium long-range precision rifles, hunting rifles, and an assortment of weapon accessories. As part of their ongoing precision rifle lineup, they have recently unveiled their latest creation, the CDX SS7 Stars, available in two variations, Pro and Covert. Featuring an incredibly short 11-inch fluted barrel, the Covert model boasts a Covert Slim titanium suppressor so minuscule that it can be housed within the rifle's M-Lock 4N tube. Despite its compactness, the 4N tube retains full functionality and includes a 19-inch Picatinny top rail, allowing for the attachment of night vision devices or other optics. The Seven Stars Covert is undeniably impressive, to the extent that it almost feels out of place on this list. However, due to regulations in the United States, the company is unable to sell the 11-inch barrel version, leaving us with 16-inch barrel variations. Additionally, the rifle's MSRP of $5,700 makes it quite costly and potentially inaccessible for many. Number 2. Bergara B14 Squared Crest for those who may be unaware, Bagara is a distinguished firearms manufacturer located in Bagara, Spain. They have earned a formidable reputation for the exceptional quality of the barrels they produce, initially crafting barrels for various gun manufacturers worldwide, ranging from the United States to Belgium and Germany. Eventually, they ventured into manufacturing complete rifles of their own, incorporating their renowned barrels. There is a rumor circulating that a chief instructor from the United States Marine Corps Precision Weapons Section joined Bergara's production team. Allegedly, his involvement led to further enhancements in the quality of Bergara barrels, cementing their status as one of the most esteemed and sought-after companies for competition and hunting rifles. Not too long ago, Bergara unveiled carbon fiber barrel versions of their Ridge and HMR rifles, demonstrating their commitment to innovation. More recently, they introduced a new rifle model called the B-14 Squared Crest. 
Bragara positions the B-14 squared crest as a culmination of the advantage found in their previous rifle models, expertly combined into this new iteration. The rifle features a carbon fiber stock meticulously crafted from resin impregnated carbon and carbon spine, resulting in a rigid, durable, and highly weather resistant structure. So why does it find itself on this list? Well, it carries a price tag of $2,000, which may not deter the very few individuals who are willing to invest in a rifle that comes with a sub-MOA guarantee. However, it's worth noting that the B-14 Ridge, offering comparable performance, costs less than half that amount. It's a puzzling aspect to consider, Bergara. Number 1. Dylan Tac 501 if you've ventured into the world of hand-loading ammunition, it's highly likely that you've come across Dillon Precision Reloading Equipment. Dillon Precision serves as one of the two sibling companies of Dillon Rifle Company, the other being Dillon Aero Inc., which specializes in armament manufacturing, particularly the development of 50 caliber gating guns. However, let's stay focused on the topic at hand. At the top of our list of the most cursed guns is the Beast TAC 501, an imposing bolt-action rifle chambered in 50 BMG. This behemoth is constructed upon the formidable Macmillan TAC 50 bolt-action rifle, known for its relatively higher weight despite its colossal presence in 50 BMG chambering. The remarkable aspect that distinguishes the Beast TAC 501 is not its size or chambering nor the rifle upon which it was built. Rather, its claim to fame lies in its exceptional accuracy. According to the Dillon Rifle Company's website, this rifle is touted as being capable of achieving sub-MOA accuracy with a trained marksman and match-grade ammunition. Given the rifle's foundation on the Macmillan TAC-50, which already boasts a formidable reputation, it is highly plausible that the Beast TAC-501 lives up to its accuracy claims. It's worth noting that the Macmillan TAC-50 currently holds the record for the longest confirmed sniper kill as of 2017. However, the curse associated with the Beast TAC-501 lies in its steep price tag. With an exorbitant SMRP of $10,500 and magazines that retail for $375 each, it becomes a significant investment for prospective buyers. So that wraps up our list of the most cursed guns of 2023. Hope you found this video insightful, and if so, please leave a thumbs up as I always appreciate that. Let us know in the comments down below which cursed gun you are going to choose. Thanks for watching, and that's all for this video. If you like this video and it helped you in any way, please like this video. And if you don't want to miss out on any future videos, subscribe to the channel.